Hi everybody, I'm gonna check very quickly the season 3 changes for Lucky Chloe. Um, what I found very interesting is that uh, she got two new moves and some adjustments. So, her 12 frame punish for a start has a just frame. If you do that in the exact time, it's gonna give you plus 5 damage and knocks down. Like this. Which is good. Otherwise, just this happens. So, um, this is a buff. Definitely a buff. Just gotta learn the timing. Another thing, always from the 2, 2, 3, 3, has more range, so it's more easily. Uh, UF3, UF3 plus 4. Now it's more faster. This move gives plus frame on block. Before, people wasn't really using it because it was kind of slow and doesn't have really a good range. But now, yeah, this is a fix, in my opinion. Um, 3 plus 4 back. Yeah, finally, they gave a cancel button for this uh, stream because before it wasn't really used for this. This is very risky. So, yeah, this is a good adjustment. Um, another thing I'm gonna say this is a good buff. Why standing free on counter it is juggle. This is good. Also, also this. You can make it. Yeah. 68 damage from UF3. So this string now it's better, it's more consistent as an ender. Before it wasn't really. You have to stay just um, in the good position or it will end it. Um, then another thing that she had. So her two new moves basically are those. This one. Which is weak. Because finally now she has a safe mid from back turns. Short range, true. But it's good. So finally she has something more from the back turn stance. And now the funny one is running 3 plus 4. So funny. So funny. This is a good a good double low. I mean, of course it's staggers on block, but still. Uh, I, at least you can use it for uh, for running people. <laughs> but they're not running around, which is so cool and fun. So that's pretty much it. That's like two season three.